Hello, my name is Kevin and welcome back to my uh, third tutorial. Uh, I'll be discussing uh, how to power pistons in this one. Uh, it's going to be a really short one, so we'll get right at it. Uh, a piston facing upwards uh, is possible to power it like this in these four directions. Yada 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 yada. And also, it's possible to place uh, a redstone torch underneath it to make it work and uh, with the use of an inverter this can be useful uh, a piston facing forward three directions like this uh, you can also power this one from the top I'll show you the pressure plate this and also from the bottom like this and let's see Ooh. this won't work so it needs to be a piston at the bottom of or uh, a redstone torch at the bottom and the next part is how to power pistons, uh, multiple uh, row of multiple pistons. That's a problem I encountered when starting off with uh, pistons. Uh, two ways you can do that. And uh, first, I need to show you this. Why the regular way doesn't work? Uh, for a piston to be powered, it needs the uh, the redstone wire needs to be pointing directly into it, like this. This works. Uh, but if we have a redstone wire that goes across it, that won't work. So it really needs to be pointing in. And there's two ways to uh, actually counter that, and it's by the use of repeaters like this. Just place a long row of repeaters behind it, a wire across it, and it works. Uh, another way you can do it, and I'll show that with the use of pistons facing upwards is by placing a row of blocks behind it like so and directing a redstone wire across it like this so that uh, the redstone wire is kind of like uh, at the top of uh, the piston and this also works so two ways to do that um, no, if you want to cover this up, this takes one, two, three, four blocks and only two high. And this takes three blocks, three high. So just to show you some dimensions for covering it up. And this is for this tutorial. As I said, it's, going, it's a really short one. Uh, next tutorial, I'll be discussing a little bit more about ticks and uh, pulsers, and we're almost ready to uh, start off with our first construction. That is a uh, power plate activated automated cobblestone factory. So, hope you enjoyed this one, and hopefully, see you next time. Bye.